World Blood Donor Day is marked in Lagos with the State Transfusion Service encouraging Nigerians to give blood to save lives. The day is marked at the State Secretariat in Alausa, Ikeja. The report. Despite the heavy downpour, people gathered to commemorate the 2023 World Donor Day with the theme, Give Blood, Give Plasma, Share Life, Share Often. Speaking to journalists at Alausa Secretariat, Lagos State Governor, Governor Babaji de Saonolu, represented by Permanent Secretary of the State, Ministry of Health, Dr. Lushegu Oboi, encouraged people to give blood and share life. The point is to encourage people to give blood. Uh, that when you give blood, you, you share life. And so, the, the, it, like I said, uh, giving blood is almost like giving uh, an organ for transplant, but it's an organ that replaces itself very quickly. So you, it's always available for you to give again and again. And blood that you don't really need. You can give a pint of blood, it doesn't do you any harm, but it can be the difference for, between life and death for other people. From the Lagos State University, Professor Dosomo Adedoin says that Nigerians should trust and have confidence and build a social support system whereby youths can come and donate voluntary to those who are about to lose their lives. It's for those who are donating to try and donate like two times in a year regularly. You can donate from the age of 18 to the age of 65 as long as you don't have any other disease. You can always donate. And this will keep you fit. Because you know that in three, four months' time, you are going to donate again. You try to keep fit. You try to avoid infections. Because you don't want to you want to qualify to give safe blood to save somebody else's life. The Director of Pathology and Laboratory Science in the Ministry, Dr. Baba Femi Thomas, said the best way for government to encourage citizens to give blood to others is through education. When, when you actually educate people and they understand the value and they understand that there's really nothing fetish to do about it, you actually realize that a lot of pe people are, have a good heart and they are willing to give this product, you understand. It's just that that barrier of that fetish that they are thinking that maybe their blood products will be eventually used for ritual purposes that will work against their own success success in life. So I think that's the that's the major thing, education. Medical professionals believe that giving blood keeps one fit and healthy.